The Ford Mustang is an iconic mean machine that is known for its roaring engines and for the longest time has represented much of the imagery of what an American muscle car should be. And as modern technology has caught on with the automotive industry, the Mustang we've all known has now taken a total shift towards a new direction by introducing the electric Mustang Mach-E. In this video, we're taking a look at the Mustang Mach-E and showing you how muscle cars are going electric. Before we jump into it, don't forget to click the like button, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for future updates. The iconic Ford Mustang is a car that is universally loved by everyone and has cemented its place as a legend. The first Ford Mustang went on sale on April 17, 1964, with 22,000 Mustangs sold on that first day. With the Ford Mustang, a new class of automobile was born, the Pony Car. The release of the Mustang created a new segment in the automotive industry. Many of its earlier generations have been featured prominently in movies, such as Gone in 60 Seconds, Goldfinger, Diamonds Are Forever, and has featured many of the best cinema or car chases in history in the 1968 thriller Bullet, alongside the equal legendary Steve McQueen, who has always had an affinity for the stallion. Now in its sixth generation, the Ford Mustang has proven to be a stylish and powerful car through each generation release. By the third and fourth generation, the Mustang got a makeover in its appearance as a way to keep with the ever-competitive automobile market. Its fifth generation release in 2004 offered a heavy revision to the Mustang's styling with new futuristic proportions while keeping the foundation of the vehicle's aesthetics. The year 2015 marked the birth of the all-new Mustang with its sixth generation reminiscent of the 1967 and 69 Mustangs as an homage to its classic style with a canted nose, a bigger grille, and round headlights. This current generation has the modern sporty look that appeals to Mustang enthusiasts and features more power and torque than ever before. After all, that's what the Mustang has always been known for, being a powerful muscle sports car. The Mustang has always been a car that combines sleek looks with high-power engines. With its low-slung, highly stylized coupe, with a long hood and short deck. And while the Mustang may be known for its powerful engines, a shift in the overall trend within the automotive industry just might make that loud roar we're used to be a bit more, shall we say, reserved. Recently, Ford announced that it was spending $29 billion towards increasing its investment in electric and autonomous vehicles. They've also announced that they will be going totally all-electric, particularly with Europe for the meantime by 2030. Ford says that it will transition to EV production gradually over the next decade, targeting zero emissions capability, all electric or plug-in hybrids by 2024. By 2030, two-thirds of its commercial vehicle sales will all be electric or plug-in hybrids, with all of its vehicles sold will be pure battery electric power. This comes as many countries, especially in European states, who have set out targets for banning traditional gas-powered cars and vans, with Norway already aiming for 2025 and France and the UK for 2040 and 2050 respectively. Several states in the US are also making aggressive target dates, with California leading the charge by vowing to ban the sale of gas-powered vehicles by 2035. This has led to the industry radically shifting and speeding up its efforts towards its electrification plans to keep pace with other automakers and push the industry towards the future. With this in mind, Ford had already announced its plans for an all-electric transit van and an all-electric version of its best-selling F-150 pickup truck. But the most anticipated release was announced in 2019 with the introduction of the revolutionary 2021 Mustang Mach-E. Blending traditional sports car style with a comfortable SUV platform, the Mustang Mach-E is Ford's broadest attempt at mainstream electric vehicles. Built from all the passion of its iconic heritage, this electric crossover SUV aims to take the charge towards Ford's new electric destination. And before purists who love their high-octane rich engines react to the radical changes of the Mustang, it'll be beneficial to get to know this all-new electric machine. The 2021 Ford Mustang Mach-E is definitely inspired by Ford's famous pony car and powered exclusively by electricity. It's important to note from the start that although it shares a name and has the familiarity of the old Mustang, this all-electric crossover can be said to be completely unrelated. This is Ford's first all-electric crossover, designed and named to pay homage to the Mach 1 moniker of the Mustangs of old. The anticipation for this all-electric crossover SUV has been quite high that it already won the 2021 North American SUV of the Year Award. The Mustang Mach-E blends typical SUV proportions with some characteristic Mustang styling details and is already considered to be the best in the luxury EV class. 
It's built on an all-new platform and is available with either 76 or 99 kilowatt hour battery, and with either a single motor that's rear-wheel drive or a twin motor for the all-wheel option. It has a range of up to 595 kilometers on a single charge and is currently one of the longest haul electric cars in the market. The Mach-E's entry level has 254 horsepower, with the stronger variant having 332 horsepower. Ford has also announced its intent to produce a GT version that could provide 480 horsepower, targeting a 0 to 100 km per hour mark in 3.5 seconds. This SUV has pop-open doors without door handles, a cabin-length UV and infrared-coated sunroof, a horizontally mounted 15.5-inch touchscreen in the middle of the denim-looking dashboard with a sizable trunk under the hood instead of the engine. There's the 402-liter cargo area with ample floor space which can also expand to add more space when seats are folded. Its body style blends Mustang details into its standard SUV body and shape, highlighting the recognizable Mustang nose, headlights, and traditional rear brake lamps. Its performance is pretty impressive. The Mach-E is absolutely so silent that it even has the option of adding an audible propulsion sound to remind you that you're driving a Mustang. There's three driving modes, active, whisper, and untamed, with each setting allowing the vehicle's computers to assist your driving experience by electronically adjusting the throttle, brake, sound generator, steering, and interior ambient lighting. Ford equipped the second-tier Mach-E with high-profile long-range all-wheel drive, which rides with reasonable dexterity. Its passive suspension does a very decent job on supporting the car through corners, while the inboard computer continually communicates what's happening at road level keeping the Mach-E in control. Its four-wheel drive version provides ample torque through the rear wheels, allowing a secure drive through any known terrain. For an everyday driving version of the Pony Car, it's pretty well balanced and fast. The Mach-E is also packed with a wide array of driver assistance technology, with key safety features providing forward collision warning and automated emergency braking, blind spot monitoring, and rear cross traffic alerts, lane departure warning, and lane keeping assistance. While the 2021 Mustang E may not be the traditional pony car famous for its legacy, it's a pretty ingenious crossover SUV that is pushing forward towards the future with the inevitably of more sustainable all-electric vehicles. Despite the actual differences, the Mach-E is still an attention grabber with a silent but instantaneous power of acceleration, making it one of the most wanted EV options in the market. The 2021 Mustang Mach-E is priced starting at $43,995. So what do you think about the Mustang Mach-E? Muscle going electric! We'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below. And if you're new to the channel, give us a like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more. Until next time!